Hey, it's from Allen Music. Today I'm going to teach you how to do rhythms number three in Sight Reading Factory. So we're going to go ahead to in Sight Reading Factory. You're going to go ahead and put in your username and password. Log in. So make sure you're under the correct class. I'm going to go into 3B, um, 4A. Hopefully you all figured out which class you're, you're in by now. Um, five, this is uh, instrumental music slash lunch for remote or lunch instrumental music okay. or third to fourth hour if you're in person. So I'm going to go to 3B. Uh, I'm going to go to rhythms number there's one, two, three. kind of goes in the opposite order. I'm going to go to rhythms number three and click on that. Um, I'm going to try it. And let's get my microphone. So make sure that you're setting this up. Um, sometimes it does it for you, but I think you're gonna have to set this up um, yourself. Um, it's gonna be four four time, and I think that's all you need to do. Um, if you don't do that, it's gonna be uh, a little bit maybe unfamiliar to you. So four four is probably the easiest time series for you to use. Um, let's see. Good with that. I'm gonna start my assignments, and here we go. You have 45 seconds. Um, if you're ready to go at any point, you can push ready. I'm going to push ready. It's going to count us off. And then you start. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to explain to you on this, on this um, screen some of these rhythms. So pretend like we were using this one. They're all slightly different, but they all use the same uh, components. So we'll be using eighth notes that are tied together, quarter notes. We have dotted half notes. Those get three counts a piece. Um, these are single eighth notes. Now you have eighth rest. Sometimes these will come in on the ends of the beats. So that single eighth note, say so check out this measure four, it's one and and three. Okay, so that's the second half of beat two. We don't say two, but we say three. That's quarter rest, one beat silence. Okay. Uh, when we're executing these rhythms, we're going to ask that you count line one and two, clap line three, so that's 9, 10, 11, 12, and then count and clap 13, 14, 15, and 16. So that's what we're going for. So when we do this, I'm going to set you up here. Um, let's see, I'm going to just take you to another one. This is the exact same thing. I'm going to go through that whole process for you, what you'll be doing. So I'm going to skip my mic check, go to 4-4 four, four time. Start my assignments. I've got 45 seconds to look at it. I feel like I'm good. I can push ready. There's going to be a four count cut um, count off, and then you're ready to go. So here is Sight Reading Factory number three rhythms. Count off and count. One and two, three, four. One, two, four. One, two, and three. And one, two, three. One, two, three, four, one and two, and four, one, and three, four and one, two, three. Clapping only, line three. One, two, three, four, one, and three. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three. Cool. So that's all good. I would submit that assignment. I feel like I got it perfect. Uh, if you need to try it again, you're able to do it one more time. Okay. So as many times as you need to do it. All right. So having said that, um, that's your assignment. What you'll be doing is you'll be going to um, uh, submit that and it's worth 16 points. So just just try and be very lenient on grades and everything. So just make sure that you're you're trying it and uh, submitting it. It's going to be due this Thursday. Um, so that's your assignment for this week. Getting that in, working on it, practicing it. You can always practice and, and keep going with that. Also, keep going with uh, the C, the F, and the B flat scales. If you have not turned that into um, Flipgrid for your B flat scales, make sure you turn that in as well. So we have this four days this week. Uh, no school on Friday. So uh, thanks a lot. Let me know if you have any questions.